Turning now to an incredible story out of Shelby County in Deep East Texas, where a family made it out safe after speeding through five East Texas towns in a runaway car. KLTV 7's Mariella Gonzalez tells us how it all ended. Tell her to pull the, tell her to pull the emergency brake. Dodging traffic, Marilyn Guardado of New Braunfels was going fast as 90 miles per hour, unable to stop her car as it sped out of garrison. She says her brakes quit working. She tried to put the car in neutral and even take the keys out of the ignition. At that point, we didn't know what was going to happen. Her husband, Chris, attempted to drive in front of her for nearly 20 minutes before calling 911. getting more worried. We wasn't even supposed to be here. Precinct 5 Constable Josh Tipton says he and Deputy John Pope were in the office reviewing paperwork when they received a call from dispatch about the runaway vehicle. Constable Tipton advised dispatch to have the husband's vehicle stay behind. Do not follow us and make this more dangerous than it is. As Guardado drove into Shelby County, Constable Tipton says... Uh, whenever we entered Timpson, the vehicle actually went on the opposite side of the road up here at the intersection of 59 and 84. Well, I've been in car pursuits, but, you know, never a runaway, you know. Pope accelerated the patrol unit to halt traffic at the upcoming intersection in Tenaha. Fortunately for them, the light was green. Of course, we got up over 100 a couple of times because we were trying to get around her to clear lights. Constable Tipton says they wanted to pull up in front of Guardado to crash into the patrol unit if needed. The plans changed. Dispatch advises there were three small children in the car. Both vehicles arrived at Joaquin. That's when Pope and Tipton saw an 18-wheeler assault truck up ahead. They sped up to tell the driver to make a full stop in front of Gordado. Get up there beside that big truck. And so we're on the back of a big truck. We're fixing to try to get him to help us. Go, 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 go. Stop, 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 John. Hey, block her in. 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 Block. Back up, John. Oh, I'm telling you, when we got them babies out, you know, then we knew, you know, we could relax that, you know, everybody was safe. So. Mariela Gonzalez, KLTV 7 News. And you heard it there. Hard to believe no one was hurt.